Are you a mother by chance? Yeah. Exciting news. I'm here on paternity leave because I got knocked up. I didn't even think guys could get pregnant, but here I, I stand corrected. This girl came on my penis. <laughs> 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 Just you saying that. <laughs> and then one of my balls actually went up, you know, like how sometimes they go like up and in. Well, and then my stomach started growing. And at first I thought it was just like I was sick or something. But then I got a ultrasound and it turns out that I'm going to have a little baby boy. And that baby boy, the craziest thing about it, it's a miracle. He's pregnant inside of me. So it's actually, I'm having twins, but not like separate. It was just a little pregnant boy is going to come out of my belly. So you're probably wondering, how can you do this? How can you get pregnant as a man? Well, first you got to get a chopper digophamy. You know, a chopper digophamy, it's a procedure where they, you know, snip it off, chop it right off. And they just, doctor comes in, snips it right off. They made some sushi out of mine at a local <laughs> Japanese restaurant. They eat them like nothing over there. They love it. So I fed a family of 12. <laughs> do you know where the paternity award is? Yeah. Okay, and talk to the, the valley office. Just go into the right and talk to the lady in the valley, valley office. They'll probably get you. Okay, thank you. Yes, sir. You said yes, sir. <laughs> the paternity award. <laughs> the paternity award. I'm going to get a, a trophy for being the first pregnant man. Oh, perfect. Do you know where the paternity award is? Paternity award? I don't know where it's at. Because I'm pregnant. I need to have this baby. I see you, man. Uh, I'll go down there and just add a little baby. <laughs> no, okay. I don't want to be a hospital prankster. Do you know where the insanity ward is? Do you know where the pissanity ward is? It's on YouTube. Three. We're going up? Yeah. You don't know where the fraternity ward is by chance, do you? No, I'm sorry. It's looking for it. Do you know where the paternity ward is by any chance? I have no idea. Oh, okay. So I gotta have this baby. Oh. I just wonder what was taking me so long. I got a vascular nose. I didn't get assaulted. This is gonna look like I'm, this is part of the prank, but it's not. Eli went to the bathroom. And when I was getting ready for the prank, I was kind of like like a little congested or something. Like I picked my nose a little bit because I couldn't get it out. And then I started bleeding like everywhere. And I didn't have any napkin and I didn't want to like, we're out filming, I don't want to get blood all over me. These two <laughs> young ladies walk by. I was like, do you guys have a napkin or anything? Like, they're like, I don't know, and like a tampon or anything. <laughs> and she gave me a tampon. <laughs> and then I said, this is super ironic because I'm pregnant. <laughs> Fuck. I gotta use the tampon. So I'm getting, the, <laughs> there's a lot of lessons today. I'm gonna, I'm not a litter. So just litter it somewhere else. Yeah, I know. Bro, what, how the f do you? <laughs> you there's no way they put that in their vagina. <laughs> Bro, there's like sharp stuff. Like, look at this. This is sharp. That would like splinter. Like, you know? So they put this up and in there, all sharp. Go like that. This thumbnail. So pregnant women do bleed. It's not a. It's a myth. <laughs> Look at. I'm Captain Jack Sparrow. Captain Embryo. <laughs> Captain Embryo. I'm Captain Jacqueline Sparrow. Looking for other periods across the land. Oh man. Well, that was a rush. You know those nosebleeds when it like, you pick it a little and it just starts fucking pouring out, dude. I was like, oh shit. Planned Parenthood wasn't open, so it looks like I'm gonna have to take responsibility for my actions and raise my child. I never should have let that girl come with my penis. They're closed, so, you know, I take this as a sign. You know, maybe it's not the right thing to do and I should, I should raise my baby. I should find a hoe to help me raise my baby. Or give it up for adoption if I can't find a hoe, so.
that's what I'm gonna do. If there's any hoes watching this, please feel free to reach out at Pisanity on Instagram uh, if you wanna help me raise my baby. Uh, I'm just looking for just one, I'm not looking for a bunch of hoes, I just want one hoe, one good hoe, and I wanna, you know, start a family, you know, maybe have some more. Oh, I hear that train, there she comes, just get on. Hi there. I got knocked up. <laughs> it is what it is. It happens. I know. Uh, she, she was a deadbeat mom. Uh, she left you? Yeah. Oh, my God. I'm homeless and I got knocked up and. I'm homeless. <laughs> I got knocked up and she left me. You guys have any recommendations for me? No, I'm broke myself Oh, okay. No, I'm, I'm, I don't need money. I, I need someone to help me raise my... I need a woman. Yeah, it's my baby. What is it? What? Holeless? Yeah, I got knocked up and then she left me, so I'm holeless now. And she was a deadbeat mom, so. Are you really looking for money? Uh, no, not for money, yeah. I just need a hoe to help me raise my baby. I don't need money. I have a home, I just don't have a hoe. I'm holeless. I'm pregnant. Zero percent hoes here. Why are you doing this? Well, I just need help raising my baby. Because I got knocked up and she left me, and now. I'm here on my own, so. Oh. I shouldn't be bending over while I'm pregnant, but. <laughs> I'm a rolling stone. You guys hook me up with someone, maybe? I, I'm holeless. Bound to roam. Come the more. You look like you might be able to help me out. You're pregnant. Don't yeah, I got knocked up and. I see the baby bump. <laughs> yeah, she was, uh, she was a deadbeat mom and she left me, so. Yeah, I'm here on my own. So, if you want to help me, maybe raise my baby with me. No, I'm good. You're I good. Work on oh, okay, okay. I'm homeless. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I got knocked up, and she. That is so amazing. Yeah, she was a deadbeat mom, and now I'm, I'm here on my own. So, if you know anyone that could help me out, maybe. I'm pregnant. Watch the trees falling leaves like the breeze want to blow on. I'm homeless. There's a maternity section, but where's the paternity section? There's plus size, but there's no negative size mannequins. They're just like imploded, like anorexic mannequins. <laughs> yeah, I mean, but seriously though, if they're gonna make heavy set mannequins, why not? Why not make really skinny ones too? <laughs> We're gonna bump babies. <laughs> Bumping babies. You know, there's bumper cars, so there's like bumper babies. <laughs> There's a maternity section, but where the hell is the paternity section? This is bullshit. I'm very offended at this. Ma'am, can you believe this? There's a maternity section, but there's no paternity section. I can't believe it either. Do you know where the paternity section is? No. Do you know where the paternity section is, ma'am? Paternity, no. Oh, okay. Because I found the maternity, I just can't. Do you know where the paternity section is, by any chance? Um, yep, right there. Yeah, well, see, yeah, that's maternity, but I was looking for the paternity. I don't think you're going to find that in here. Oh, they don't have it? No. Dang. No. Aw. Oh, I don't know what I'm going to do. I need supplies for my you baby. You do need supplies for a baby. You might have to just go in the men's department and get a 3X. Oh, that's a smart idea. I didn't think and of that. And do it that way. That's genius. I'm going to do that. Yeah. Well, congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. It's going right. to be a boy. All right. Yeah. You're going to name him and, after you? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to name him Chris. Chris. All right. And Very he's good. pregnant too. Huh? He's pregnant already. The baby pregnant already too? Yeah. Wow. It's like double. That's amazing. 
It's twins. <laughs> you guys don't know where the paternity section is by any chance, see? Eh? Oh, do. <laughs> <laughs> do you know where the paternity section is? It should be right here. Yeah, well that's the maternity. I was looking for the paternity. The pisanity section? You don't know? Okay. <laughs> This is the uh, baby section. It's gonna be for you. You're gonna be playing in this one, or do you want the little one? And this is gonna be perfect for you. Oh, I like this, because he's gonna grow up to be smart. He's gonna understand the concept of time. The little hourglass, and the, a little squeaky toy, because he's a little dog. Babies are just basically dogs. I like that one. And then I need to get one for his baby. I'm gonna have to get two. Baby. Excuse me, are, are you a mother by chance? Yeah. You are? Yeah. What type of baby food do you get? I was wondering what the best would be for my son. What? I was wondering what type of baby food would be the best. Oh, I don't know. Sorry. Okay. Just if you had like a recommended brand or... She's so weird at my maternity photos. Little baby Chris. And his mother's name was Ruth. <laughs> was what? Ruth. Ruth. Ruth's Chris. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I got a married woman named Ruth now. That's genius. I'm ruthless. <laughs> Cause I oh, yeah, hold up. Something doesn't feel right. I uh, I don't know. Something's happening, dude. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. Two hours later. You're not gonna believe it. I wasn't pregnant. Look at this. I wasn't even pregnant, I just had to go number two. I'm kind of sad because I really did want to have a son, but maybe someday. This whole time, this whole video, I had no idea. Little did I know, it was just a big shit. Just had to take a big old poop, so. All right, guess I'm not a dad. I was just filming a YouTube video, just letting you know. No, you're fine. I was like, that's funny. I like the earrings though. And I don't want to like do this to put anyone down, and I know some people, there's a group of people who will get very offended at this, but I mean, come on, guys can't get pregnant, let's be real. <laughs> They're gonna be so pissed when I say that. It's one thing, if you wanna get a chopper dig off me and pretend that you're a girl, chop it right off. I don't want kids growing up thinking that, like, that's the normal thing to do. Like, obviously it would be chop it dig off me. Nowadays, they do that to every boy when they're born. Instead of circumcising them. Yeah, they just chop the dick off. We don't need those anymore. <laughs> Let's do a little clapski on the crescendo. Great for mature.